and how's everybody doing out there today? This is Tamir's here, and today we have... It, it looks like it says Organ Sphere, but the store page says it's Organosphere. So, just remember, that's, that's not a random hex, that's a stylized O. This art style kind of seems infinity-like. That's interesting. So, it's early access, and it looks like it's in a parody of Johannesburg in South Africa. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to say Johannesburg. Not sure if it's supposed to be Johannesburg or Johannesburg. I'm not sure. I'm just going to roll with what I said. But you're in a... I'm going to say parody Johannesburg. But, um... Yeah, there's, like, plants and bugs. And you have guns. And shoot them. This is what it is so far. Let's go ahead and hit new game. It's the Biocorp Laps. You wake in a room of darkness. Giant deformed beetles and bodies lay amongst you as you try grasp onto the very last thread of remaining sanity. And then there's some hints. Press any key to continue. The space bar functions on that. Okay, so immediately it is dark and blurry. So there's that going for it. Use mouse to look around and waz keys to move. When on arm, hold the right mouse button for more precise movement. You need to escape the laboratory and find a way to defend yourself. Okay. We're moving quite slowly. Could be covered in blood. All right. Right mouse button thing is not sure. Ooh, in dark situations, you can activate your light by pressing L. You can also find batteries around the city to increase the brightness. Yeah. Okay. I, I guess it works. It works much better at a wide angle shot. It does closer on there. Okay. Where to go? Don't worry, it's an open world game, so... They're supposed to be wandering. Right? Okay. Well, here's some stuff on the ground. And a wall-mounted computer. Let's go this way. And here's some plants. I'm just now noticing it's incredibly quiet. There we go. I had to turn up the headphones a little bit. I guess I wasn't missing much. Well, we continue to move slowly. There's all kinds of light effects dancing around. Oh, there's stuff. An adrenaline sh uh, syringe. And a police shot. We are now in first person. Okay. And now we're moving faster. I think uh, the real game is about to begin here. Organosphere allows seamless transition between first and between third and first person, I read it backwards. In most situations, you can switch between each mode by pressing F. Each mode has different tactical advantages. Well, for one and third, it doesn't look like I can aim until I do right mouse button, but in first person, I have crosshairs anyway. Okay. That's the thing. Your little weapon with R, holster weapons with H, aim with right mouse and fire with left. At least it's informing me of the controls. It's a bug! I shot the bug. And there's dead person. They didn't shoot the bug. Breathing there is weird. Take that flying bug. Take that, you flying bug. We 
you have enough adrenaline indicated by the hexagon icon above health in the bottom left hand corner, you can press Q to enter a hyper reaction mode, a grateful side effect of many years of voluntary company sample testing. Press Q now to tactically combat the mutated bees. But I don't see any of the bees. Okay. So it's bolt time. That's pretty much what it is. You quit with the heavy breathing. I mean, really now. Okay, so it pulls out while you're reloading. Alright. Now my adrenaline meter says I'm at zero. And I appear to still be in it. To heal yourself, press tab to access inventory items. Right click on a healing item and select use to increase health. At least it's making sense. You know, I really don't want to use that right now since it gives me 25 health. We get 100 adrenaline and we have cash one. Whilst almost worthless can still be used in exchange for goods and services. How do you know it's almost worthless? Are we just already making a stab at economic statuses of the world? Okay. So if I go in, I appear to just be stuck in until I go out. Press E to use the exit door. Yo, Hazardberg City Center. Yes. Is that a Tokalashi? Not sure what that is. Perhaps that is a South African thing, and that's why I don't understand. Objective added, code red. Learn to use L for your light. And O to check current objective. Well, you didn't tell me that before. Okay. Eh, it, the, the flashlight doesn't seem so bad outside. I can live with this kind of flashlight. Rizlor. Oh, lithium ion matches? Is that, that's weird. Identity document. Those eyes are kind of weird to read next to those brackets. That's, that's kind of why I'm tripping up here. A Rizlor. And a Bamzoo healing salve. And a trash bin. Which has wooden animals, cabbage, and an old book. Take all. Why not? I just realized my gun's not even fully loaded. Let's fix that. Okay. Uh, we do have a sprint key. I just wasn't permitted to use it earlier. Can I not jump over these trees? Pumba chips. I missed what that one was. I'll just take these metal bowls. I'm sure they'll be useful at some point. What it's choosing to select when I can pick things up is kind of odd. pick any of those up. Doesn't look like I can pick any of that up. Bunny chow. More bunny chow. Bunny chow. Beef and veg. Alright. So... Now what? Code red. Search city for survivors. The usual rally points for evacuations are towers and other tall landmarks due to their high visibility. There's a tall building. Is this supposed to be like a baby crying or something? I don't care about you, baby. There's a bug apocalypse going on. A bug eclipse, if you will. There's a trash can in the middle of the street. Is that, is that some pizza? Why don't we take the pizza? What kind of nonsense is this? Okay. All right. I wonder if I have a crouch key. Not sure. Oh, 
Invisible wall, I went somewhere I wasn't supposed to go. Well then. I guess joke's on me, maybe? Why does this have to be at night? It's a bee! Take that. Now the music's picking up. Now we're ready to go. Ready to rock and roll. Let's do this. I have a feeling there's going to be a lot of wandering about in this game. Food items. Wow, that really tank there. Alright. The music stopped, so I guess that means there's uh, no more bugs of the bug eclipse around. Mattress. Let's sleep until it's brighter. There we go. Still pretty dark. The darkness moves with us. Well, that's something I think we can say of real life, really. Why does the darkness follow us? This is just ribbon tape. How dare this get in my way? Well, it's either ribbon tape or it's just very thin plywood. Nonetheless, it should not be in my way. Yet it is. Okay. It's open world design right there. Found some tents. Perhaps there are perhaps there are people hiding out here. So I can speak straight. I can't ever speak straight though. What am I talking about? Uh doesn't, doesn't look like it. There's some things we can pick up and a campfire. I lit the campfire. Do something with the campfire. No, I don't. I don't want to sleep. I don't. I don't think I can do anything with the campfire. That that piece of wood says something. Please hip my cut. What? C pi pi e. My neighbor's chicken need money for. Zooming in doesn't help. Okay, I'm, I'm not sure if that's what that sign actually is trying to say. I'm gonna go with no, that's not what the, trying, the sign is trying to say. Discovered. I'm not even gonna try and say that. Because I know I'll get it wrong. Oh, there was a thing I could pick up. Thinking of all these identity tokens, so I'll at least be able to pretend to be, well, anybody. Whenever I find anybody. Then I can pretend to be somebody else. And then when I find somebody else, I can again pretend to be somebody else. Trash bin. Take all of that. Why the heck not? Hmm. Strange. It said it was a duplicate store and was a bag of Boomba chips floating in the sky. Take that grill. There wasn't even anything in you. All right. I feel I'd have a bit more to talk about in this world space if I've been to Johannesburg so I could comment on accurate or inaccurate representations of the place. I don't think it has see-through gravel though. So I'm sure it's got that going for it. Now if anybody's going to get upset about me going into these places that I probably shouldn't be going, well this game said it had open world spaces, you have to deal with the consequences of promising me that. 
I've played enough Elder Scroll games to know you just kind of glitch your way up mountainsides to get places. You can also do it kind of in Fallout games too. And I believe I've gone and gotten ourselves stuck. It's okay, I can still kill the bug. Whoa! That happened. So I was stuck trying to get out. I switched camera controls over to third person and it was rocketed into the sky. So that happened. Alright. Okay, just do some weird little roll, why don't you? When we go here, taking you all with us. All right. I think we can go back to first person. It's a bit easier to just navigate the world space. Okay, I need to find somewhere tall. That looks tall. Oh, that also looks tall. So, find somewhere tall. There is a weapon on the side of a nearby vehicle. Walk up to it and press E to collect it. But these bugs are walking in place. Oh, there it is. A first aid box. An AK-42. All right. It's dead. Can't tell it's still moving around. Well, at least the iron sights function and make sense. That's good. There's too many games on Steam that give you iron sights, and there's absolutely zero point to them existing. All right, so we fought ourselves some beetles. Come out on top. We have. Proved that a gun can still defeat the might of exoskeleton. Despite the fact that these bugs clearly have some kind of super mega science exoskeleton, because the atmosphere has not crushed them. Because that's that's the limiting factor for bugs on both insects and arachnids is uh, why they are the size they are, is because the air itself would just crush them if they were if they became bigger like that was a big thing that I had with the Ant-Man movie when they made the giant dog sized ant is there has to be more than just messing with the space between atoms and the Ant-Man sites because either that ant would become big and probably die because it would have the consistency of styrofoam at that point or the ant would become big and then die immediately because the air would literally kill it. So there's more going on to that size manipulation than they're letting on. And it may become a major plot point for all I know. Well, I ran past the tall building. There's a tall building with advertisement on it. I think we should run over there because surely we can trust a big business. In this case, because it's Coca-Cola. Crack. Crack Cola. Oh, those sound like very trustworthy people. Ah! We can't handle that jump. Are you serious? Alright. So now we are pretty well back on course from where we died last time. And I did end up finding something very interesting, very controversial in this game here. Uh, hang on, folks, because right here, we got ourselves a frying pan. As we all know, this is completely iconic and unique and copyrightable to Players Unknown Battlegrounds. So, unfortunately, developers of Organosphere, you probably got a lawsuit coming your way because you dared dared to copy 
players unknown battleground and put a frying pan in the game i mean how could you guys what fiends what fiendish plots you have devised by putting a frying pan in your game i bet next you're gonna tell me there's some kind of reference to some form of poultry i mean who would dare put poultry in their game you would be clearly trying to just rip off is that a pig that's a hippo it's a statue of a hippo thank god i don't think we'd be able to handle a hippo i do mean that in all seriousness i know how absolutely freakishly dangerous a hippo is they are some terrifying animals Consume Chapa Cola. Consume it. It has demanded it. Okay, we found ourselves a pharmacy. Let me in. Let me in. I want to loot the place. Well, my immersion of this open environment has been completely torn asunder. Take all. I don't know why I necessarily need all the stuff I'm picking up. I just know I want it. I want it! I want the stuff! It's a shack. Just jump on top of somebody's shack. I think it is a shack, but they've boarded up. How dare they! I wanted to poke my head in and say hello. What the hell? Beetle! Take that! Better heal, I'm a little low on my 125 health. And... I'm not... I'm not actually sure... what all this is. Use. 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 Drop. Can't do anything with that. Uh. No. Can't lock it. Light fires. Use. That should be good. That should be good enough for now. Right? Where's that... Where's that crack cola tower? I was trying to head to the crack cola tower. I need to remember my objective here. Otherwise I'm just gonna keep wandering with nothing happening. Oh, there was something I could pick up back there. Let's go see what that was. Pick up beer! And you know what? Drink that shit. There we go. Some good old fashioned beer vision. Oh god, that is getting kind of sickening. Take that, you bee, I'm pretty sure I saw. Alright. Is this. I think this is the Cracktola. Crack Cola. Not the Cracktola. Crack Cola Tower. We should just call it a crack tola tower. Oh, that. This camera sh makes this person seem pretty tall. I mean, they would not be able to fit through these doors. When I go in third person, they can sort of fit. So, that's a thing. Okay, we found a suitably. Oh, I found some other stuff to pick up. I might want it. Probably won it. I'm sure I won it somewhere. We found the tower. Ponte Towers plus 500 experience. There's freaking experience in this game? What do I do with that? Not that. I see you. Take that, you insect. And I mean that literally, not figuratively. 
Okay. I shall beat you with the power of another game! Okay, right trigger doesn't give a block. I wasn't sure if there was blocking in this game. There appears to not be. Take that! Yes. Yes. That's probably a complete waste, but you know what? Whatever. Get some of that. Why not? Why not with all this stuff? Take all that. Take all that. Because again, why not? That is the motto of today. Why not? Violent students confront teacher. I'm sure they deserved it. Whoa, bug! I don't know why I jumped so much at that. I really don't. But you know what? I'm gonna roll with it. Because I guess this game wants to be a scary game, right? Well, I know I'm about out of ammunition. And I haven't found any more of that. So, ah, that looks like that's how I should go to woman L's her ex's car for drugs. Perhaps it's supposed to be sales. But I like it as woman L's her ex's car for drugs. Makes it seem like it's local lingo. Husband has the mind of a baby. I'm sure there are many people that would say that. There's a snake in my stomach. Did you eat it? CEO smokes Neop at work. I'm sure I didn't pronounce that correctly. Well, this is mildly entertaining to read these headlines. And we are reaching the repeats. Bug! I don't know how that damn thing snuck up on me. Okay. There's a computer. Can't do anything with it though. Ah, excellent. A highly useless weapon in the real world and as it turns out in the game it's not really a very well received or even really all that useful firearm can't reload my shotgun interesting i should probably use some of the heals though there we go use 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 the shrooms. Use that. And use that, whatever that was. Oh god, it was alcohol. Well, that's probably nauseating. And that's just even worse. As I sit here and do things to make it worse. That's just awful. I get what you're going for, but that's just awful. Now we have some giant mushrooms. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about those, but they're there. Did I just completely miss where I was supposed to go? Is that what all this is? I'm just wandering around aimlessly trying to start something that should have been started long ago I I really just don't know perhaps there's something on top of this tank Get out of my way holes get out, get out of the way I have a feeling this tank was placed and then the stairs were placed on it 
Of course, maybe it's just a challenge. Some kind of physical challenge. That did not have payoff. Condemned settlement, 500 experience. Why was it condemned? Probably because they never placed a floor in this building. There's some more buildings that didn't get floors put in. I mean, that's only like step two of making a building is putting in something that vaguely resembles a floor. Step one's dig the hole to put the foundation of the building in. I'm not counting all the contract negotiating and shit like that because it's boring. It's boring stuff. Somebody's shooting at us! Let's go closer. Perhaps they've mistaken us for a bug and they actually wish to talk. Thankfully, they are wildly inaccurate. It was only a flesh wound! Do not worry, friend, I can forgive! Hello, friend! You have a gas mask on. Why are you wearing a gas mask? Was this a costume party? This is a costume party. Okay. Okay, guys. Seriously. Like, there's... There's some weird shit going on. There's giant bugs. We should, like, do something about that. Okay? Guys. But seriously. You can keep wasting your bullets, but that's, uh... That's a pretty poor use of resources. I mean, here. I mean, this is how you do it, guys. You you fire lethal bullets lethally. He took forever to get killed. Use gas mask. I am using the gas mask. I don't know what it's doing, but I'm using it. God damn it! Yeah. I'm gonna use the shit out of this gas mask. How do you like that? How do you like that gas mask? Getting all used. Ah. Well, apparently it's attracted a bee! But it's dead now. Um, use the cigarettes. Eat that. Eat some more. Eat, get more. Oh my god, I have infinite meat! Well, I shall want for nothing now. Yep, it's still there. Alright. Infinite meat. I like it. Excuse me! Excuse me! Excuse me, fine people! Hello! How are you doing today? Did you notice any uh, giant bugs? How we have a gigantic bug apocalypse going? It's quite strange. Uh, tell me, have you seen anybody else? I was magically instructed that I should seek out tall towers to find people, but, uh, that has not yet occurred. Uh, excuse me a moment. Your bullets make me ravenous. And I would like to rectify that issue. I, I thank you for the kindness in allowing me to satiate my appetite, fine gentlemen. Now then. Which direction shall we head to find more people in the Bug Eclipse? I I have named it the Bug Eclipse. You may use it, but uh, I, I I request that you credit me in that. Ah, a new friend. Hello, good sir. Why you're not friendly at all? Trying to shoot me with your gun? Man, I am really working up an appetite here. Pardon me. All right, there we go. Come, friends, you shall now be my followers. And we will go off questing, slaying more bugs. And we'll kill people like this. I never liked this guy anyway. I prefer you two. You're much chattier, much friendlier. You are quite friendly indeed, good sirs. You make me very hungry, though. Excuse me while I solve that problem yet again. 
Now, perhaps you guys could help me, but, um, would there perhaps be a dry cleaner around? I seem to have, uh, well, uh, as you can tell here, uh, blood on my coat. Uh, you can't go walk around with blood on your coat in a bug eclipse. That's just unsanitary. It's unsightly. It's very ill-mannered of us when we find new people. They're just gonna look at me and be like, Oh no, it's some kind of vicious raider that's come to kill us and steal our supplies. So, I'd be giving them the wrong impression, and I really don't want to do that. I would much rather they look at me and be, Ah, yes, another neon-haired person. Perhaps they are here to assist. And that would be... That would be the preferable way. I would like to approach, approach this with uh, some tact and diplomacy, like I've done with you two. You know, this is going to be a sort of a beautiful friendship. I can just feel it. 